If you are also running a business, you probably relate this story. So it was around 3 a.m. in Bangladesh time. So I was like, you know, go through for new clients. Suddenly on my WhatsApp, one of my clients just hit me up. He said, Abrar, I need a quick thumbnail. At that moment, like no designers was available. But in this era, everything is possible. So with Nano Banana, Chat GPT and Canva, I made a very simple thumbnail for my clients. Today, I will showcase you how I create this kind of thumbnails. Please keep that in mind. I'm not a graphic designer. My team does this graphic designing video editing work. By the way, if you are new in this channel, then welcome. This is Abra Fardin and you are watching a production YouTube channel. All right. So at the very first, what we're going to do is basically we need to take a screenshot. So we will find a portion where client is a little bit of smile a little bit of pausing or anything like that that kind of part we can use for screenshot all you need to do just take a screenshot currently I'm using Mac so on my Mac it is command shift 4 so command shift 4 and then take a screenshot Please keep that in mind whenever you're taking screenshot, it should be from the raw video because if you try to take a screenshot from your edited video, then there will be captions or graphics or any kind of PNG popping up every single time. So it will be not a good fit. Anyway, just click on the done button to download this or save it to your system. Then upload to Canva. Here we will drop the picture and i will also share this complete thumbnail package in the description box below so let's take a page here all right then just import this photo here okay it's look good then go to position then layers and delete this image as you can see it looks dull obviously if you have also similar picture then click on your image then go to edit section and click on the adjust button and just simply you know adjust the contrast highlight shadows whites whatever you prefer so we will boost the contrast then a little bit of highlight shadows whites i think yeah then you can also add vibrance so if you add vibrance you can see i don't like that much vibrance so i will go with thin and you can also add a little bit of sharpness and clarity yeah that's all and also you can pull up the brightness or a little bit down whatever you prefer again contrast is most important always try to contrast your photo to look more cool or look more cinematic perfect okay now before we save this photo we need to hide this text because uh, we don't want to do this at this moment so we will pull up here to hide all the text then go to share then click on the download and click on the current page done download raw photo v1 okay because this is a raw photo anyway click on the save button now for the second stage we need google nano banana if you don't have the subscription don't worry you can use lmarena.ai from here you can choose the direct chat option and here you will see many kind of chatbot or ai models gemini then c dream new model from china you know everything is included here for completely free yes it is for educational purpose so don't misuse this gemini 2.5 flash image preview nano banana click on here then import the photo here we go ladies and gentlemen please focus on my words at this moment you can use any kind of prompt it might be this or it might be from v2 all of the prompts has been generated by chat gpt and some of my cheat code formula you can use this prompt if you want just copy the prompt then go to lm arena then paste the prompt then hit enter and wait for a few seconds around 14 to 15 seconds for c dream model you need around 40 seconds to one minute because c dream china model is little bit slow rather than gemini 
as you can see our photo is ready in the raw photo you can clearly see it doesn't look good even the sharpness and clarity is missing but in the edited photo you can clearly see there is a bit sharpness there is a facial structure enhance and it looks overall good if you don't like if any case then you can just click on the retry button and you can again regenerate this whole image it is kind of closer to the previous one if you don't like the prompt you can simply again go to my canva the link will be found in the description box below then you can put this prompt and again upload the picture this prompt will make the client a bit more luxury and everything. It also changes the outfit and everything. This prompt was kind of one of my favorite prompt. As you can see, it looks a lot different because, you know, end of the day, people like cinematic vibe. You can play with this prompt. As you can see, it looks quite cinematic because in the prompt i said you know a nighttime view of a five-star hotel then graded with teal and orange that's why it has a teal and orange vibe you know teal colors in the background and orange in the face and everything so if in any case you don't like my prompts then simply just open chat gpt you can simply like copy some of my prompts like you just copy this prompts paste it here and you can change some of the parts let's say uh, i said like replace the background with minimalistic indoor setup you can you can tell it outdoor setup uh with sofa small green leaf you can you can tell here uh desk mm, then laptop in the background at the end you need to type this give me a prompt for nano banana or fix this prompt with my request please don't judge me i'm not good at typing and everything so it's kind of mess i know as you can see he will give you a very realistic prompt you can play with this prompt as well so let me just try this copy lm arena click on new chat then you can pull this here paste it here again you have gemini 2.5 and c dream model you can use c dream 4 this is up to you but c dream takes a little bit longer time like one minute or 1.5 minutes sometimes it it takes less time like 45 seconds but it is quite slow damn bro this is crazy right see see the details wow it is absolutely fire man here is my photo just pull up here bam here we go okay then go to position there will be a drop shadow in my canva project link but if any case there is no drop shadow you found or there is a drop shadow glitch what are you gonna do basically go to element section and search for drop shadow okay so basically if you put a drop shadow from the graphics tab there will be lots of drop shadow so it will very easy to read the text okay so if we just uh, pull up this drop shadow yeah you can clearly see we can easily see the text now rather than before but there is a problem with the face it looks a little bit dark don't worry go to position try to narrow down it okay it looks good actually huh now as you can see it looks good so from position you can just uh, choose the layer and you can just pull up here or down whatever you prefer but i like this kind of shape where there will be a little bit of gradient or little bit of drop shadow from the bottom so and now you can just pull a text like 10 years of identify programming you can say like a day in my life that's all you can pull this here then here if you want a better thumbnail you can play with the fonts you can play with the text and everything let's say create a new identity we will copy this and paste here as you can see it looks already good you can change the position 
OK, OK. Uh, then you can add a different font. Let's say we will go with Futura. Futura is good. Yeah, it looks good. You can change the text color or even you can use the neon effect. I like neon effect in the white text. You know, it looks very dope. You can create a thumbnail less than a 15 minute or 10 minute it's that much easy create a new identity as you can see also you can play with shadow some background little bit of see our thumbnail is ready all right, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any suggestions or if you have any ideas in your mind, then please let me know in the comment section below. I will try my best to create that kind of video for the future. And if you're new to the channel, then please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon. This is Abra Fardin and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.